Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you how to create a simple web browser using C Sharp. First of all, I will increase the size of the form to 820 and 470, that is for width and height in pixels, in order to see the whole web page at once. Then I will add a panel with size near 800 and 400 in pixels to place the web browser content. You can adjust this panel 1 to the top of the form. We need another panel for placing address bar and go button that contains in a normal web browser. Let's add that panel too. And place that new panel to the top of our form. Let's place the text box that we hope to type the URL address that we need to load to our web browser. I'll make the length of this text box to 700 pixels. And then name this text box as text box address in order to identify it easily. Let's add a button too. I will name it as button go and change its text to go. Then what we are missing now is an object to place the web browser content. There is an object called web browser under toolboxes of Visual Studio we will use this web browser component to show the web browser content. You can drag and drop that to the panel 1. Then we can move to the code and change the button pressed event. What we need is when the go button is pressed, the address in text box address get loaded to the web browser component. We can type web browser one dot navigate and within brackets type text box address dot text that will load the content of the web browser address to the web browser object. Let's run the project. I will type the URL of Google and press go. It will eventually load the Google home page to our web browser object. You can do a normal search and experience it. Let's go to another page. Let's try with Facebook. I will type the URL address of Facebook and press go. That will work fine. As you can see. Thank you for following this tutorial.